Seasons change even on Mars. A look at how NASA's explorers study the weather and cope with change, especially in the case of the Ingenuity helicopter, which now has to fly in a thinner atmosphere. This visualization, known as NASA's eyes, shows where the agency's two rovers and lander are touring the planet. For most of them, measuring the weather is a key part of their job. It's early summer in Jezero Crater, where NASA's Perseverance rover and the Ingenuity helicopter are exploring the South Seder region. Perseverance uses its Mars Environmental Dynamics Analyzer, or META, to measure temperature, humidity, wind speed, and direction. These wind sensors also measure the amount and size of dust particles in the atmosphere, helping scientists understand the dust cycle and its impact on weather. META also provides the Ingenuity helicopter with critical pre-flight weather forecasts. Recently, warmer temperatures and a thinning atmosphere have made it more difficult for the helicopter to generate enough lift to fly. Its rotors had to spin faster than they had in previous flights, roughly 2,700 revolutions a minute. In the Southern Hemisphere, where the Curiosity rover is driving in Gale Crater, it's early winter. The rover environmental monitoring station, REMS, provides daily weather reports and takes regular dust surveys to measure seasonal changes over time. The InSight lander is focused on what's happening below ground. In September, it measured one of the biggest, longest lasting Mars quakes ever detected. Seismic waves from the magnitude 4.2 shook InSight for nearly an hour and a half. Finally, the fleet of orbiters, including Odyssey, the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter, and MAVEN helps scientists understand the scope and scale of storms from above. MRO produces a daily global weather map and provides us with amazing images. If you're interested in dunes on other worlds, check out these recent photos. To get the latest updates, follow at NASA JPL and at NASA Mars on social media or take a deeper dive on the mission websites at mars.nasa.gov.